Sundays, no name working engine idled on the runway. Known to blow vocabulary open, but it's pure precision. Display x ray, can see why they ignore the vision. If it doesn't bubble on the surface, doesn't mean it isn't cooking, only means it's deeper than people are looking. Throw a sinker on a line and let the hook drop. A modern thinker of his time is teaching book hop. A modern inker of the lines using a tool of type and rhythm that's akin to the enlightenment if you're in the writing. Unconventional, like suddenly school's exciting, brighter than a firefly ignited under cooler lighting. Full as a tick and sharp as a tack The spark and a match to cause it a tingle down the middle of your back The pause and the action cause it the effect Properly adept, probably a wreck from the start But a mark off the check Off the scoreboard, off the floor, nothing but the bottom Couldn't afford him in the store, but he fucking bought him I'ma take a breather, be right back Letting my anchor bury deep into this track On the avenue, I'm dipping my bus pass Underground, I get to go and hop the fire train Green circles in my eyes, daily rush past Only gotta hold Open the class to me off the chain on the avenue i'm dipping my bus pass underground i get to go and hop the five train green circles in my eyes daily rush past only gotta open the class to me off the chain the meat and potatoes equal the speaker and beat maker every single digit got the rhythm i'm the heat sprayer you need a layer of fire retort and fabric attack level is hazardous as a backdraft of black magic cracking doors open all right folks uh what do you know there's somehow more peggle to do <laughs> well, there wasn't any more official peggles, so we made our own. I was gonna say with blackjack and hookers, but then the song said with hipster chicks. And I was like, excuse the fuck out of me. Let's get this out of here before I get copyright claimed too much. So, it's true, boys and girls. There is a, uh, those of you who remember Bickman... Bickman is to Pickman as this is to Peggle. This is called Pegged, and somebody sent this in. It's, uh, this is not, this, this art is uh, unrelated. This is its own atrocity. I, I've spent a long time looking at this picture and trying to just figure out the whole deal. Because it's, it's got a purple version of my logo. But I assume that was just like a pepper in Codename Kids Next Door. It's got fucking... I think that's Habibi Hamoud hair. It's got Hey Arnold. It's got Ed, Ed and Eddie. This orange face I've like seen, but I don't... I don't know what that is. And there's like a Jojo background. And there's fucking loss. And he's, he's sipping out of the Aqua Teen Hunger Force guy. I don't even fucking know, man. I don't know where to begin with this image. So I'm not even gonna try. But I'm excited. I don't know. I googled the quote and it's, it's I, I've not seen it anywhere else. I, it was one of those things where like you do Google reverse image search and it says no results found and you hear like a church bell tolling in the distance and like, ah, ah, you know, like the birds. It's, it, it disturbs you to your core. Uh, anyway. Let's get the game. In fact, I want you guys to see the intro too. That's very important. It's not by Pop Cap, it's by Cap Cap. And uh, this is pegged. I bet you can't even tell they edited that name. We'll wait for it. <laughs> that was a gnome. That was a Harry Potter gnome. And yes, the loading bar had a penis. An ASCII penis. So here we go, folks. It's it's one of these. I know very little about this. Hopefully, it doesn't get like inappropriate. I, I kind of doubt it will. I know there's there's custom levels. Uh, so yeah, let me know if everything's looking and sounding all right and all that. You won't last five minutes. And I've, this is all I've seen. It's got Cuphead on the main menu. Uh, I made a new name, Schmickhead, so that we can do adventure mode again. Without being spoiled. 
and it's like Cuphead themed and here's the Inkwell Isles. I don't know, man. I, I think the whole thing is not Cuphead themed. Uh, but let's go, adventure, let's go. It's all more. This is, wait, this has got Neil Cicerega. That's the Mouth Moods album art. All right, I'm all Omar. This is, I mean, flashbacks to, to, to Bickman already. Uh, this, is that is that sound level? Does that music sound all right? Let me know. I guess once it gets drums, it'll be even louder. I'm Olimar, captain of the SS Dolphin. Me and ten of my peg-mastering friends are ready to teach you how to get the most out of your pegged experience. And since I have the super guide ability, I get to go first. All right, hey, fuck yeah. Uh-oh, it looks like my ship is covered in pegs. God, the Neil Cicerega is here, too. Oh, look, there's Bike Borb. All right. It's the Space Jump Galaxy. This is all fraud. All right, fuck yeah. Look at that. He's up there. Does he, he doesn't face the direction that you're moving. Oh, no, wait. Oh, never mind. Oh, right. They, uh... It's, they, they point at the ball. It's been a little while since I've played actual Peggle. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, that's for, like, Pog plays. That's a good quality of life tweak. Ah, oh, man, I, don't, I, I didn't think about that, but yeah, there will probably be some sort of download available for this game. I'll, I'll contact the creator, they're probably watching. What do you think Ode to Joy is gonna get replaced by? I don't know. Uh, does this seem, does the game seem a little loud to you guys? Maybe just a little bit? Good volume? Sound is fine. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm getting like 90% totally okay. 1% just a tiny skosh. And I'm gonna go with tiny skosh because I'm looking at the actual bars. Um. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Well. <laughs> That freaked me out. I was not expecting that. This looks like a proper thing. I was kind of worried that this was not going to be like a full hack. Uh, no green pegs so far. For some reason. I don't know what's up with that. Ooh. Ha-cha! Is that a Pog? Pog play? <laughs> no, that wasn't. That was not particularly Pog. There's been, like, power creep for what I consider Pog. Like, you look at the first Peggle video, and, and you see these, like, mediocre plays. I, I'm actually gonna save that one. <laughs> uh, but... You see these bad plays, and I'm just freaking out about it, and it's- it's fucking cringe, mate! Still got it. It never leaves yet. Oh god, this angle's gonna be weird. Woo! I'm saving these just on, like, the joke that it's Pog now. All right, classic trick. Nope. <laughs> Everybody knows Wraithroot's classic. Oh, what was that? Was Luigi on the coin? Holy shit, I need to not fast forward through that next time. There you go. We're never gonna see it. Ode to Joy is still Ode to Joy. Trash! Look at that! Also, there's that Lanky Kong. Trash. <laughs> Good. Oh, God. We gotta go with, like... You always think Olimar would be like, because he's tiny. But in the games, he's like, Whoa. So his voice would be like, The best way to learn is to jump right in. 
This looks weird. You know what they look like? They look like the the Radians. Or rather the Gradians. Uh does anybody remember those from De Blob? They were like colorful people in like these weird suits. In like George Orwell world. Just like took out that winged Pikmin's brain. Brain stem severed. These are like actually real levels too. I, I fear that it's gonna get. Uh, they said that it does get difficult. I fear it's gonna get to CBT. Maybe not though. Ba -ba -a -e. Yeah. Pog. I, I, it just feels good to press the pog button. I feel like a twat saving those because it's like it's recorded. I'm recording it right now. But you, you gotta hit the pog button when you get a cool play. Gotta hit the pog button. Do you think De Blob was a children's rendition of 1985? Yeah, that that song by Bowling for Soup. The anthem of a generation. 1985. Um... Already I'm suffering from the, uh... Oh. Woo! The, uh, the, the, the presence of these blocks. These always are the things that I struggle with. Maybe, of course, once I get more Peggle Master abilities. We're looking at a first L here. Folks, as cool as this round has been. do it, but this is looking tricky. <laughs> Why do you have a mouth? Me? Are you talking about the blue Pikmin? Are you talking to me, the streamer? I just gotta go with the heart of the cards. There's no good way to do this, man. Heart of the cards. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Am I going to 100% this one? I don't know. Maybe not. I've, I've done my fucking, like, time 100%ing Peggle games, right? I like the song that goes... goes Shit. How's my hand today? I actually have a new stream setup configuration. Uh just to accommodate tendonitis. Uh, so I've got my crazy weird mouse. Oh, look at this. This shit never happened in normal Peggle because they never left pegs just lying completely flat. Uh, it's, it's better. Actually, it's kind of better and worse. My thumb is not nearly as numb anymore and it's clearly like getting feeling back to it. Uh, is this guy carrying a hop? Is that a hop for like beer? Uh, but the, the pain is worse. But, uh, I, I, I am trying to deliberately play games that take it easy on my hand. Fuck! Get at least one. Thank you. <laughs> so I have a different stream setup, so I'm not putting stress on my hand. I have, I, it's kind of like I'm arm wrestling, I have my elbow on the table. Why did yesterday's stream cut so abruptly? Because I got eaten by the creepy pasta. It was funny. It was supposed to be. It was like a funny. Never mind. 
I heard my mom calling. Uh, this one guy over here. Look at fucking. This is like. It looks like South Park. <laughs> it's like Kenny. That's the one thing I know about South Park is Kenny. Mm. This is doable, but it's, it's not ideal. I want to go for these ones first so I can get the maybe get a free cheese ball on that. Nope. Okay. Well, that works too. That works just fine, actually. Mm. It could have worked better. Come on, come on. I don't like this shot. Oh. Okay, alright, that's fine. I have neighbors. I need to not do that. Right in the trash. Cool. Gaming. Pog. Hit the pog button. <laughs> it's important, not just in pegging, but in life, to think of the angles and carefully consider the consequences of your choices, like yelling and making loud singing Three Stooges sounds uh, and annoying my neighbors. Hope you get better, Grapefruit. Thanks. I I want to be funny, but I'm, I'm just working on it. Oh, the wrist! Didum tish. Oh, you mean the wrist. So now I actually have abilities. It doesn't give you abilities for the first couple levels? It's kind of weird. Oh, I didn't remember that. You don't miss it till it's gone. Alright. Carefully consider my angles, you say. You mean like this? Oh. Awful. Oh, oh, just miserable. Oh, stinky angle. I wonder if there's like middle frames for Olimar. There's gotta be, right? There has to be. <laughs> ah, no! Oh! Mm. Is there like an in between frame? Oh, I have no idea. If there is, it's so fast that I can't even tell. You could put all sorts of like messed up shit there. That was a bad shot. That was pretty awful. I found that generally the strat is to start higher up, just so that like the by like. Statistically, you're gonna hit more pegs that way. Okay. Hmm? No. It is entirely possible they just cut it out. Hmm. Uh, I just made like a Pikmin exertion noise. Is this gonna bounce off? Yes, it is. Shit. <laughs> How's that gonna do? Well, oh, that was pretty bad. Look at that. Let's just take a dang look at that. Woo! That was pretty good. Wow! All right. From a dire situation to one where I can put a little bit of fucking English on the ball. Why? Why did I... Why did I do that? Wait, now I don't have super guide. I can still do it. I can still do it. Wasted. <laughs> Alright, let's watch it go right in that trash. Let's see it, boys. Trash. Trash time. Oh my... Nope. No, 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 no. No, no, no. It can still go in the trash. No, that's looking like a 50k. Never mind. Strike that bit from the record. It's pretty embarrassing. Uh, whoever made this 
There's, there's two blue Pikmin, there's two yellow Pikmin, there's two red Pikmin. Have they ever even played Pikmin before? Oh my god! They don't know the lore. Oh no, an enemy. Quickly defeat it before it eats all the Pikmin. Imagine if there was like real enemies now in Peggle. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa. Let's try this out. Mm. Well, at least I got the purple peg. At least I still have my personality. Yeah, I, somebody mentioned right when I started streaming, they were like, wow, how rude Lark is streaming right now. And you're streaming fucking Peggle? I was like, ah, oh, shit. I'm sorry, I didn't, re I, I didn't realize. It's not intentional. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a pretty good shot, actually. That was pretty good, all right. I yeah, don't tutorialize me, game. Tutorialize the, the game. I don't know how the game works. Woo! Are you going to play more Portal? Yeah, probably in, in some way, shape, or form. Oh! wanted to use the super guide while I had it. <sighs> Shit. No, okay, well. There goes the swag attempt. There goes the swag 100% attempt. right into the trash. Those of you who watched the 100%ing uh, streams, uh, you know, and especially the ace scores, that was just the bane of my existence in uh, Peggle Knights. It's toe late. It's, I mean, it's still pronounced two. I'm just being a dick. We weren't fast enough, run. Fine tune your shot with the mouse wheel to distract the bull board. Alright, come on, get a little bit of slide going. No, oh, ruined all the slide, actually. We can maybe still salvage something. Uh, is that gonna work? No. No. No, that's not true. That's impossible! Hmm. Uh, what do you mean about this being left-leaning, chat? Is the audio coming from the left side more than the right? Oh Jesus, I feel a sneeze. She'll be coming down the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming down the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming down the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming down the mountain when she comes. 
it's it, it went away this knees went away I shouldn't have sang coming around the mountain I should have done like if I had a hammer or something shit like that is it ever gonna go away oh, oh. if I had a hammer they, they sneezes love that one piss off She'll be riding three white horses when she comes! Isn't that what they say? Some shit like that? Oh, who the fuck rides three horses? Woo! It's fine. Achoo. Okay, that's it, right? Yeah. Now to just 100% the level with two balls. Is that gonna work? I didn't even need the super guide. Let's see how much of a super gamer I am. Okay, that worked. Oh shit, oh I accidentally moved the mouse while I was looking. That sucks. Alright, well. well. I looked away at chat, and then I clicked, and I accidentally moved the mouse a little. Right in the trash. Right in the trash. Oh my god. I a fan. <laughs> it's like nobody can do this guy's voice. Patrick Warburton is unimitatable. <laughs> I just like melted while saying that. All right, we have a long day ahead of us. Brock Sampson, the second Peggle Master. Is this is like, this is his Poker Night Two art. Yeah. Specialize in giving the balls to do stuff. He's got like a- he's such a weird voice actor. I always remember him as, uh... Not as Joe Swanson or whatever, but as Putty on Seinfeld. It's true, uh, The Venture Brothers, one of the best fucking shows ever, got cancelled recently. Hopefully they get picked up by something, I don't know. Nothing's ever really gone. <laughs> Oh shit! Oh shit! I, f I forgot this is uh, <laughs> Jimmy Lightning. So we got multi ball and it <laughs> plays a little bit of the Venture Brothers theme. That's cute. It scared the shit out of me. Uh, cloning, uh, potentially. But yeah, now I can chill the Venture Brothers. Because I feel like the show just never gets enough credit. It's so good, and I feel like most people have, like, at least heard of it. But, uh, it's got, like, kind of a rough first season. Which is why I feel like a lot of people, uh, maybe try it out and then don't continue with it. But, let me just say, it becomes, like, truly legendary. It gets the Grapefruit, uh, seal of endorsement, for sure. By the way, I'm not- I'm not coming in from the right or from the left, am I? Somebody said something about how this is a left-leaning stream, and I was like, what does that even mean? The song is just diagonal. Wow. Okay. Oh, I see. Uh, did I ever watch XRA? Yes, I love XRA. It's a great show. The thing I always say about Venture Brothers is, uh... If you like Rick and Morty, you'll love the Venture Brothers. Because the Venture Brothers was kind of doing shit that Rick and Morty does now, like, 20 years ago or whatever. Not to sound elitist, that's just true. Whoa. Try harder! Oh, I didn't even notice it said VB, I'm an idiot. 
Alright, also, this is the clear optimal- Oh! I'm gonna say it, the slides. They're not like lined up properly to get good slides, and it keeps giving me blue balls. You heard like out loud blue balls exclamation just now. Also, this is an awful placement for this. That's spooked me. This is already definitely more challenging than normal Peggle. I tell you, it's these, like, shapes. It's the shapes made out of blocks that do it. Oh, fuck. No. No. Hmm. How to Drink did an episode with Doc's drinks. That's pretty good. Like the Red Moco Cooler. There's a great interview with James Urbaniak, who plays Dr. Venture and several other characters on Venture Brothers. It's one of those shows where, like, every voice actor does, like, ten parts. Uh, there's a great interview with James Urbaniak in, like, sitting in a bathtub with some guy. I guess the guy's, like, whole gimmick is that he interviews people in the bath. That's my shtick. Shit. Ooh, barely. Oh yeah, and One Punch Man. It's very similar to One Punch Man. It's got the whole, uh, like, syndicated heroes and villains organization thing. Ah. You know what I actually watched the other day was, uh, I was watching Star Trek. And I was like, you know what, I'm gonna check out Lower Decks. And, uh, I watched it, and I gotta say, guys, it was actually pretty good. It was a good episode of Star Trek The Next Generation. Uh, that new TV show looks horrible, by the way. Oh my god. I gotta kill this croc before it attacks anyone else. This is from the sequence in the, like, pilot episode with, like, really jank animation. Must have crawled onto Doc's ship when we were in the swamp. Um, there's gotta be... I wish I had, like, a uh, super guide here. <laughs> no, to those of you who didn't, uh... There's an episode of TNG that's just called Lower Decks, and it's actually got, like, a super similar premise to, like, the Rick and Morty-ass, like, fucking YouTube-ass show. Uh, but I was, of course, referring to the TNG episode. Uh, the show looks really bad. It's one of those things where, like, in the trailer, whoa. The best joke in the trailer, like, the, the highlight of the whole trailer was just people screaming. There were, like, no actual, like, humor. It was just like, oh, isn't it funny that it's Star Trek, but it's a cartoon? I was like, gee whiz, that is pretty funny. Yeah, I was making what's known as a funny, I guess, in some cultures. I, I kind of love that that show, like, when it came out, everyone was like, no. Nobody wanted this. Nobody. Ooh. Oh yeah, sorry, Andrew, you can't raid me. I'm gonna be honest, I got raided by like a semi-big channel once and I was like, never again. And that was like two years ago. I was just like, this sucks. Shit. But no, the, the episode, the TNG episode, it like threw me off because it was about Four, like, junior officers on the Enterprise, like, being quirky, and I was like, oh, is, like, the show based on this one episode? It's very weird. I'll talk more Star Trek, uh, when I play more FTL. Holy fuck, this is, uh, my, my hero, my little hero academia reference, I'm pretty sure. I don't know this character, I've just seen this picture. Also, okay. 
is true that many good shows have bad trailers. Brock would never have a Deadpool watch, by the way. I'm sure this just belonged to, like, whatever cosplayer is doing this. But, like, Brock would not be caught fucking dead wearing, a, a, like, a, a branded watch, especially of Deadpool. <laughs> They're the same picture. <laughs> like, uh, Nirvana the Band the Show has bad trailers. I'm trying to think, there's another... What's another thing? I mean, even most great things, you can't really capture their essence in a trailer. Especially when the people making that trailer are like, No, we have to make it like other trailers. We have to make it go... Do you ever notice they all have, like, dynamic music, like they're all edited to the beat. Every commercial nowadays is like, dun dun da da You know, they all do that. It's super annoying and I love dynamic music. This guy, he's dressed like Star Fox. He's dressed like fucking James McCloud. Fuck. Oh. Oh, that was bad. I was doing so well, and then in one shot, all of a sudden, I was doing terrible. That didn't actually help. Oh, piss off, mate. Okay. Oh shit, what did it say? I didn't see what it said. I'm so used to just immediately restarting again. That's a good place for that multi-ball. That's like the perfect spot. Oh. Oh, oh. Nice. Ooh, can I do this? Hold on. There's never just been like a straight down line of blocks here. Come on. No, very sad, very sad. This is, this is the song that goes and then it goes But yeah, that first season of Venture Brothers, it's not that terrible. It's not like awful. I, Cause I gotta say like there are some shows like that, like Always Sunny in Philadelphia where like the first season you're just like, oh man. This is rough. Ah. Uh, did it like right during the music pause. Uh, Parks and Rec too. That was one where like the whole show was just like people grimacing and going awkward. And it was like, oh fun. I liked The Office too. But then Parks and Rec actually became its own amazing thing from there. And became more than the colon forward slash emoji personified. <laughs> nice. Nice. I did it. Oh, right in the trash. It, it genuinely does happen. I mean, it's like, that's like uh, Plinko logic. It's like statistically more likely to go in the trash. Oh my god. Did, did Sheldon show up? I didn't see that. I genuinely didn't even, like my mind blanked it out if it was there. But none of the slides work. <laughs> Is it ever gonna stop? Okay. <laughs> I think it has like a couple fail safes there. Kind of, it's kind of like Dark Souls in that regard, that it has a falling forever fail safe. <laughs> well, I don't know. People, uh, it's you know, first season of Always Sunny is not all like terrible, but it's got a lot of like unfunny moments, and and it was like. Always Sunny season one was very like proud of itself, you know? It was kind of like a very smug show. 
where they were like, ah, look how crazy we are. <laughs> look how fucking like uh, no other show would do this. <laughs> we're ridiculous. And then later on, they kind of like unstuck their heads from their asses and got a little funnier where it, it would have felt like even if they were, if they had remained that smug, it would have been at least deserved. But in the early season, I, it just felt, the whole thing, I, it was just kind of like, mm, funny. <laughs> but Danny DeVito got that show on fucking track, man. Yeah, I guess it's a limitation of uh, the, the level creator. There's also a, there's a Peggle Knights level creator that is, uh, <laughs> I love that it always takes forever for these to dis disappear. It's, it's usable, but it's kind of jank, and I think it doesn't allow for you to make, like, curved blocks, if I recall correctly. Something like that. But as it happens, good time to talk about it, uh, I, today I was almost gonna do a level pack of Peggle Knights levels that somebody sent in, but I think I'm actually gonna wait uh, for a few more people to send some in, and then I can that can be like its own stream. So if any of you out there have ever wanted to do that, uh, check it out. There's there's like an online Peggle Knights modding tool. <laughs> Weirdly enough, I am so screwed. By the way. <laughs> <laughs> He's got like, it looks like he's got like ram horns. Yep, 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 yo, yep. I can't wait till I get the fireball ability. I feel like that's gonna be my go to. <laughs> takes ages. Hey, can you guys see my mouse? Yeah, you can. Uh, do, can we get the custom cursor? Yeah. What is life without the custom PopCap Games cursors? That wasn't even very good. That's so sad. It, like, this is cool, and I get that that's just a limitation of it, but that's unfortunate that the slides don't work. I mean, we wouldn't... Not really at a perfect angle to do it in the first place, I guess. <laughs> So yeah, a while ago I was informed that the uh, the level editor doesn't have a lot of uh, oh shit <laughs> doesn't have a lot of options that you would want because I think it's fan made. All right, get a little bit to go in there. What about community? A similar case, a very similar case. You guys remember the season finale of Community? Where the like 35 year old guy and the like 16 year old kiss and there's like emotional music. <laughs> I was watching that and I was like, fucking huh? I really feel like the show never really owned up to that either. I think at, at certain points they demonstrated self-awareness a little bit, but... Uh... I was always like, what? <laughs> Thanks, Dan Harmon. <laughs> well, and the thing is, they were more... The, the characters on the show were more, like, meta-repulsed at, uh, the season where Dan Harmon wasn't a writer. Because they, they refer to that as, like, the gas leak year or whatever, the gas leak season. Whereas the, the, the underage assault season? No. Trash. No, it wasn't, like, centralized around that. It was just a really weird moment right at the end, and I was like, huh? Oh, look at this, cute. Sometimes after a long day out, I sit back and play a game with the boys. Wanna be dealt in? It's like about as close as I can get. Patrick Warburton's got a gift of a voice. Like, 
it's can you imagine if Patrick Warburton had just been like a bricklayer in his life or something? Or you like, I make I make steel wool and had never used his amazing voice in like a thousand things. What a cursed world that would be. What a horrible ultimate timeline. Use a community reference. This is from the Poker Night 2 commercial, by the way, which is a great commercial. It's the one where they like they turn right to the camera and they're like, but we'll need another player, and then all the trumpets go, and it like goes into gameplay. It's cheesy and I love it. Brock fits the style for Poker Night perfectly. I would love to see a Poker Night 3, even though it will probably never happen, of course. For many reasons. One of which being Telltale went bye-bye. Yep, yep, yup. Yup, yup, yup. Yep, yep, yup. Shit. Right, there's certain, with, with voice acting and with doing like impressions, sometimes there's like a trigger phrase. Oh shit. That will, uh, that'll like help you get into like the voice a little better. With Brock, it's right. <laughs> he's in that bit in the fucking Emperor's New Shoes. The poison for Cusco. Cusco's poison. So yeah, I don't- uh, because of the limitations of the editor, I don't think it'll be, uh, like a recurring- a huge recurring thing, but I think I'll do this stream and then I'll do one stream of user-submitted Peggle Knights levels. Uh, and then I will probably truly ditch Peggle Deluxe, although it's always- it's always comes- always comes around. There's always more ways to play it, apparently. That's nice, game. Thanks, game. Uh, shit, I really wish I had- like, the dragon- once I unlock the dragon... I mean, I guess in adventure mode you have to use the respective Peggle Masters, unfortunately, but once I get the dragon, if, if I do like the challenges and shit, I will exclusively be using the dragon for the challenges because of the, uh, all the blocks. <laughs> nice! That was good! Uh... You know, I just noticed it says Pog up here, too. It, like, flashes it. Okay... Yeah, so there was never an official level editor for Peggle Knights or Peggle Deluxe. So that, that's why it's a little crust. Oh, oh, come on, come on! Oh, so many, so many ways you could have gone there to give me a free ball, and you chose none of them. Oh, that was a good one. Oh, that was a good one. Okay, that was actually good. Could have been better! Could have been better! Oh, wow, that was amazing. Okay. Well, folks. Yeah, I, I don't think I'll be 100%ing this. Oh! Watch out, Tig Tone. There's only three balls left. Is that gonna hit it? Might go right underneath, honestly. We still haven't seen what's on the other side of the coin, by the way, because I haven't missed a single shot ever. And and what do you know, folks? What's this? What's this? I detect. What's what's that? I do I smell some trash? Carfield, the face of comics. I'm sorry, who are you? Friend of John's, you say? 
the fuck voice is that? That's like, that's not Bill Murray. What is, what is this? He's got like extra, he's got a second set of ears or some shit. Also, what is challenge? Is this, does it just list all the challenges? I'm wondering what like these pictures are. Oh God. Sup. <laughs> Thanks for the peggle wisdom. Lasagna. And it's got his fucking stuffed bear up there. Nice Garfield deep cut. Nice. Oh, and it's pyramid power, of course. Oh. Oh my god, the pyramid is made of, like, lasagna and pasta? You're kidding me. I don't know what that song was. Was there Garfield music? It's like the theme to the Garfield show. I did have a couple Garfield, like, tapes when I was a kid. One of them was called Garfield's Nine Lives, and it showed Garfield dying a bunch of times. <laughs> that is technically true. Bouncing. Yeah. Uh, what, was there like a weird particle effect down there that was also the like teddy bear or some shit? Am I, am I thinking straight? Ooh. By the way, is, is, uh, is Andrew here? Is, is Lark still here? People have been requesting that we play No Straight Roads together and I'm, I'm inclined to. We might still wait for uh, the Switch version to get updated, or I might just end up shelling out 40 more bucks for like the PC version or whatever. But I think that'd be fun. And I keep thinking about that game, because I was I was enjoying like the visuals and shit, and I feel like I was just starting to get the hang of like the combat and like what was going on uh, by the end of that one stream. But it really fucked up my hand, so it's gonna need to be a little while. This is very easy and relaxed on my hand. I'm, I'm very happy with this new setup. Well, that's cool. What? Wait. <laughs> this one's unaltered. This one's not saying, like, get good, scrub. It just says, it takes five turns. Watch the symbol, dick bone. Cool. Cool. This might take multiple streams, even, to play. We'll see. He was headed off to edit a punch-out vid. Sad. But also good. We might have that video out by this weekend. By, like, Sunday. I guess it is the weekend. Maybe. That is a solid maybe. Much more likely that it does not come out. But, uh... Potentially. I'm very excited to watch it. I gotta be honest, I said this before, but when Andrew sends me a new video that he edited, I, I typically smoke a large doink and then watch it while shoving handfuls of popcorn into my face, like that one Michael Jackson gif. Yeah, I know. Whoa. Alright. Oh, come on. Oh. <laughs> Would you enjoy in encountering this Garfield in an alley and him going, hey, to you? That's, the, that's what this pose is. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> no! Come on, please. Ugh. But uh, there's, I gotta be honest, guys, there's so many games I've just been itching to play lately, and I just can't because my hand is not doing so great. Uh, so, there will be, oh god, more JoJo podcasts in the future, as well as, uh, more review streams, uh, that was a quite, uh, quite not popular stream, it wasn't like people hated it, but... 
there were like distinctly fewer viewers on the VOD and the uh, stream itself. But I'm gonna do more of those. <laughs> uh, and I'm gonna do some like point and click adventures where I can have this similar setup and just be having mild amounts of motion. Any like first person shooters or games, any sort of like action games, I'm probably not gonna wanna play for a little while. So Spooktober, like I was saying the other day, is probably gonna have Grim Fandango. Uh, if I beat Grim Fandango, it'll probably also have something else. Maybe Oxen Free and uh, or or Day of the Tentacle, which I have not played either of those, but I have played Grim Fandango. And I'll, some other spook games. I've got some others lined up as well. Every Spooktober, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna play so many scary games, and I'm gonna go so crazy, and then I just don't. And it, it's looking like this year's shaping up to be another kind of like, play some spooky-ish games. <laughs> but it's Psychonauts last year, which is, ooh, vaguely spooky, but uh, it's not like a Halloween game, you know? No, no, don't go out there, no! Also, I'm just gonna say it, if that was the last orange peg in the level, and every other peg was destroyed, it would be literally impossible. Just saying. It would be like actually impossible to beat the level at that point. Come on, yeah. What is a paranormal experience you've had? I, I don't really have any. That's my story. <laughs> ah, shit. This is... I mean, look at this. Look at this clusterfuck down here. <laughs> what am I supposed to do about this nonsense? <gasps> G Wiener, two bills. Alright, I like that two of the pegs are just his eyes. <sighs> well, I want the amazing pyramid power for absolutely as long as possible. That's the issue. That's that's the real strat is to have the incredible pyramid power. Man, can you guys wait till we get the flower power? What a good one. As in a good joke that anyone would want the flower power. Come on. <laughs> How many more Flash Game Fridays will there be? I have no idea. I have no plans of stopping him soon. I will not be stopping at the end of 2020. I think that's the most common, like, misconception. I will not be ending at the end of 2020. I still have access to, like, most Flash games ever. So don't worry about that. Oh! But I, I will probably stop the series eventually. I'll probably just be like, hey, I've had enough. <laughs> Ooh. Pyramid Power really helped out there. Shoutouts to Pyramid Power. God damn it. Pyramid Power actually, like, actively sucks. Because it doesn't go all the way, like, if it just went all, all the way over to the right side and left side of the screen, then it wouldn't suck, but it just sucks as is. There you go. Not worthless, but it, it, it kind of sucks. I'm gonna try to get two birds, one stone here. Nice, nice. I got like <laughs> two birds with like negative one stone. Shit. Shit. Oh. Huh? 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 Ah! Ah! 
Um, sure. Let's go like right there. I'm trying to see if I can like bucket this. Nope. Fuck it, let's just play a little safe here. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> We're gonna get- oh no, don't go in the trash. I did it. Wow. Garfield defeated. Oh lord. They are not important. What's- what's on the computer screen there, John? What you looking at? What you looking at, John? What is that you got there? <laughs> I should have saved that. Why didn't I save that as a pog shot? <laughs> People are amazed that that shot even just got into not trash. It didn't go in the 100k or anything, it just wasn't trash. Oh, 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 piss, piss. How do I save state? Shine sprite. Shine sprite. Shine sprite. Okay. Okay, Odie. Time to go into orbit, you stupid mutt! Do you think Jim Davis knows about Gazorpazorp feel? Do you think Jim Davis knows about Lasagna Cat? Do you think Jim Davis knows? Like, generally, it's kind of like a Smash Mouth type situation. Oh, fuck! I didn't mean to do that, but that worked out. Garm Field. Cool. Yeah, I genuinely, I don't want to know what's on that computer screen. I'm sure it's something horrible. Oh shit. It's his line of sight with the lasagna. That's that's cute. <laughs> Meow, I'm the fucking cat character. Go yuck. Go right in there. Oh right, it's gonna take like a billion years. Well, that was a pretty good couple of shots there. I feel like that's sealed my victory right there. Woo! It's like I'm glad it's uh, actually custom levels and not just like JPEGs over, like, it's sitting behind normal Peggle. Oh, look at that. Look how much I managed to screw it up. Bum, bum, bum. Wow, I kind of cleaned up shop there, actually. Shop, mate. Okay. All right, I'm gonna get like the pizza rebound. You ready? Boom. Pizza rebound. Don't get right in the trash. That's my classic move. When I played basketball in high school, man, they couldn't stop me pulling that move. Cool. Is this just gonna... Come on. No. 
want at least one good slide. There's no slides. Oh shit, no, I didn't. I didn't need to click, I accidentally clicked. I'm not amazing with this new mouse. I wasn't watching that last shot, so it, should, it could have been something amazing and I wouldn't even know. I did hear the free ball sound. It's going all over the place. I think it'll work. Yeah, no, mmm. Alright. Sometimes it bounces right over the hole. That's not good. There's only one hole and one thing that I want bouncing over it. Alright? That was that was a poorly thought out joke. You guys remember fifth base? Was that a meme or was that like an inside joke amongst me and my friends? Fifth base. Where you like put your balls in someone's ass. Anybody else have that? It was, uh... What are the... What are the, how do they go? It goes French, feel, finger, fuck, and oh my god, your balls are in my ass. I'll tell you how, how they do it. They take a hoop earring and they use the hoop earring to prop open said booty hole. And then you put the balls in and you remove the hoop earring and the booty hole closes around the balls. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I'm just gonna finish the level. Right, then we're out of here. We're out of here. Trash. Putting a dog in a bathtub. <laughs> That's awful. Shut up, please. Do you guys remember Elysium? It was that movie? It was that Neil Blomkamp movie? Right around the point where everybody was like, Alright, Neil Blomkamp, do you got any more, like, ideas? Uh, besides this one? But he was- he's like talking to a guy at like a booth. And it's like a little robot guy. And he just keeps- the robot dude keeps interrupting him and going, STOP TALKING! STOP TALKING! And that's what I think of sometimes. That's what I like imagine chat as. This little robot going, STOP TALKING! This is reminiscent of those little window Garfields, you know? I wonder if maybe this was like a, a joke about those in the movie, right? Do you guys know the story about a guy who like, his Garfield window clingy thing saved him from like getting shot? It like took a bullet for him or something like that. I remember reading about that. Maybe it was like a Snoopy or something. There was some like cartoon animal. Whoa. Do the game determines which hole your ball will fall into by the quality of your improv? I believe that's Kane and Lynch 2, actually, that you're thinking of. Ah. Garfield kind of looks like Wilford Brimley. He's even got Field in his name. Also, Wilford Brimley died. Right in the trash? No, nope, never mind. See, the, the Wilford Brimley poor taste joke was great. The heavy. You want to learn heavy? <laughs> Many peg need gone. Oh my god. This is interesting art. What is his, what is this ability? The explosion? No doubt. His fucking face. Oh. 
All of you are dead! Jesus fucking Christ. Uh, including Wilfred Brimley, who I'm hearing from chat was a raging homophobe. Fun to know! Let's cancel him. Nice. Huh. 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 Is Peggle your favorite game? No. No. Don't worry. I'm not like that far gone. Mamma <laughs> mia! Yeah, it's actually the only game I own. Don't have any other games. I've always, I've always wanted more. Mario looks great. That was the clutch that I needed. That was the plan. Ooh. Fuck it. Did you get a Peggle tattoo? No. No. Oh, what the fuck is this? It's like mean mugging me, man. I don't like this. All of you are dead. A shame. We'll get the green one. Eh, that works. Meh. Meh. Ba -ba -bee -ba. God damn it. <laughs> it's like a skull. It's saying, like, kill him. Nice. The explosion is like the next best thing to the dragon uh, in terms of getting rid of blocks like that. So I'm I'm happy. And now we wait. Oh. All right. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Maybe it will coincidentally drop in. Let's see. Oh. Ah. Uh, I don't think it will. Huh? Oh! Ah! <laughs> boom, boom. Look at this. Medic's got the... <laughs> Everyone else is over here looking epic. And he's over here going like... Dor! With the clown nose. Have you guys seen that picture of the dude who, he was like a comedian and there was some like article, wow, there was some article in a newspaper that was like, it was like a picture of him that was taken for some like charity event or something and then it was, it was really unfortunate, uh, you know what, there was a really unfortunate headline, I'm gonna go get it. Hold on. I think I heard about it in Reply All, the podcast. <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> oh, God. That's so unfortunate. He's just shrugging like, uh, what are you going to do? <laughs> just, just unfortunate. Just unfortunate. Oh, shit. Okay. But that's what the medic's expression reminded me of. And right in the trash. Move payload here, we need to move the payload. Oh, what a shit place for the explosion. Look at that, that got four blue pegs. Yuck. Puke. 
vomit. Andrew, you gotta pick me up and drive me to your house so that we can play more Hollow Knight sometime. You are dead. I've been thinking about Hollow Knight. Oh, that was good. <laughs> Make a date of it. Put on your Sunday best. Put on your Sunday clothes, there's lots of world out there. I was in Hello Dolly in, in high school. So I actually sang that song, I was part of the chorus. I wasn't a main character. I went to audition and I was like, I want to do, and it was kind of one of those like, you know, choose whatever song and the piano player will just play it. Bring like sheet music. And I was like, I want to do Blackbird by the Beatles because that's a song I can actually sing kind of well. And, uh, and the teacher was like, how about you sing Happy Birthday? I was like, I can do that too. <laughs> they knew I was like, they, they were like, no matter how well this guy sings, he's too weird to be any sort of character. <laughs> my, my drama teacher really did not like me very much, uh, because I was a slight scrote. I was a bit of a, like, look at me, look how weird I am kind of child. So she was very, very dismissive of me. <laughs> I didn't really mind. I, I didn't want a main part in Hello Dolly anyway, so I was fine with it. Drama was a, a mixed bag. Whoa. For me. It was kind of fun. It was kind of awful. Nice. Oh god, dancing. It's not just a Fortnite thing now, it's a fucking TF2 thing. So they added congas. That was a really great place for an explosion, actually. Hell yeah. All of you are dead! I seem to remember Blackbird by the Beatles is like it's like ripped off from some like uh, slavery era poem. I'm pretty sure. Isn't that a thing? There's like a poem from like the Civil Rights era uh, or something like that. That's that says like try to see with sunken eyes, try to fly with broken wings. And then those are like the exact lyrics in Blackbird. Isn't that a thing? I feel like we like read that poem in high school. And I was like, I was like the only person in the class who was like, wait, what the fuck? This is fucking Beatles lyrics. And everybody else was like, nerd! Execution style. Execution style. Execution style. Oh, nice. This is good. This is good art. Oh yeah, Heavy and uh, and Brock have both been in Poker Night games, even though they're not the same Poker Night game. Oh man, that's a tight gap. All of you are dead! <laughs> Actually, this is the second time the Heavy has appeared in, Like, this one isn't even that ridiculous. Because there was literally Peggle Extreme that had the Heavy in it, and he came up and he went, Good job! Or whatever. This background is a visual clusterfuck for this game, I will say. The, like, red and white style. All of you are dead! Ba -ba -bum, bum, 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 bum. 
Again, what are your thoughts on the 3D Mario All-Stars? Sorry, is this a question that's been repeated many times? Well, I've also repeated my opinion on Mario 3D All-Stars many times, as it happens, but I'm basically lukewarm on it. I don't know. It, it, I'm not as, like, outraged as some people seem to be. Uh, I won't, I won't be getting it, but it's cool that it exists. I don't know. <laughs> oh. I've heard there are some, like, issues, like... Some of the games, the camera controls are, like, not amazing, or they, like, inverted some axes that they weren't supposed to, or some shit like that. And there's, like, some minor bugs here and there. But, uh... They seem fine. It's- they seem- it seems like they look good. I mean... So many people got their hopes up because... All the, like, leaks were saying, Oh, there's gonna be a remake of Mario 64! And everybody was like, oh, a remake! Well, time to expect that and throw a fit when it doesn't happen. Uh, and, I don't know. I think people don't realize that remaking a game is, like, actually a huge amount of work compared to porting it. You know? It's like a big fucking project. It's like, only a slight step below just making an original game, you know? Well, I mean, the, I've heard there are camera issues beyond Mario 64's camera normally sucking ass. What do you think of John Lennon's Imagine? Could, I mean, okay, this is no, no pun intended, but can you imagine if I just said, I fucking hate that song, man. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Oh, the people. Fuck you, John Lennon. God. What was he going on about? No, that's a great song, of course. It's like kind of sad. <laughs> it's sad to listen to. It's a bittersweet tune. I'm sure there's somebody out there who's like, oh, what a shitty song. I, I've heard a lot of like, okay, somebody said it's a, not a port, it's a remaster. What the fuck ever. It's like basically the same game with slight visual improvements. I've also heard some people- oh, nice! I've also heard some people saying it's a, uh, it's technically emulated and not a port, and it's like, that's another- that's- that's an especially a what-the-fuck-ever moment. Where it's like, okay, well, it's the fucking video game again, and they didn't remodel everything. That's what they- that's what people mean. You know? So, uh, Mr. Game & Watch's text is going over everything else? I don't know, I don't read binary. We need fucking, like, Bender in here to read it. I'm just kidding, of course. Bender only has passing binary. Uh, he's from Mexico. He only knows enough binary to ask where the bathroom is. That was a bit of a slide. Like, yeah, I think we all would have enjoyed if they had, like, tweaked the games, made, like, a bunch of quality of life improvements, but, uh... Oh! Oh, shit! Oh, shit, that's amazing! Look at that shit! I didn't realize this was Flipper's level. That's awesome! <laughs> yeah, get it in there! Oh, that's great! How fucking delightful! You're flipping it like a little sausage! The one with the frying pan one is especially appropriate, of course. The flag doesn't even really make sense, but whatever. I'll allow it. It's great. That's adorable. Nice. 
That, that's, that's really cute. Good touch. The opposite of bad touch. <laughs> and it, I like that it even makes little sounds. And it makes his like final smash sound effect when it powers up. Me. Come on. Uh, ooh. Flipper maniac. Maniac. Yeah, I know. I said maniac twice. Pog. Bum, bum, bum. Hm. Yeah, it does say neutral B up there. Oh. What if Game & Watch had an in-between frame that was just a line? That would truly be a, like a next level detail. This is my favorite one so far, of course, because it's got these unique graphics. Shit. I need to not go too fast, because I'm getting sloppy and I'm hurting my wrist. Scrolling is one thing that my, my muscles do not like doing right now. Do you think you could win a national Super Smash Bros. slash Melee tournament, or Melee slash Ultimate tournament with Game & Watch if you practiced enough? Yes, if I practiced enough to win, then I could win. But that would be a lot of practice. I don't- I don't know what you're saying. I don't know what this is. You might be saying some, like, horrible things for all I know. Terrible, terrible things. Mr. Kamen Watch, no, you'll get cancelled! Nice. I was looking away so I didn't get the flippers. Huh. The penal! The match! go off at a funky angle. Bit of a funky, funny angle. Hypotenuse. Come on, do something. No. No. <laughs> this is a bad sitch. Is that gonna work? No! Okay. I'm making good progress. 5-2. Something. Uh, to the creator, I, know, I, I saw you in chat earlier. Uh, are there challenges for this as well? Any, like, s extra stuff besides uh, adventure mode? Or is it just adventure mode? That's so cute. Shit. Mm. Challenges are all the same. Okay. Woo! Alright, well then, I, I will probably just do this all in one stream, I guess. And then, uh... I can probably skip the challenges. Maybe I'll do one or two for fun. <laughs> oh, thank you for the translations. The first binary quote was referring to poggers, and one of them just said nothing. The word nothing. Schmoov! 
moving! Oh my god. Yeah, uh, take your screenshot. <laughs> we'll see what that says. Nice, flip out. Is this like fan art or something? Because it's, it's Game & Watch and it says Schmoovin. I've never seen this before, but this might have been drawn specifically grapefruit related, for all I know. It might just be a coincidence. Schmoovin is not my original invention. No, no, no. That's what that made me think of when I made that sound. Even though it doesn't sa didn't sound like anything in Amazing Grace, it had the same like. Oh, oh what? Oh, I clicked on the edge of the window and it froze the game and uh, freaked me the fuck out for a momento. Una momenta. Viva los zapatos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lovely. Great use of flippers. moving on the level. Well, very nicely done, I'd say. Bada bing, bada boom! Ultra, that's our first ultra, I think, today. No trash here. Simp? <laughs> hey! Hey! Oh my god. That is mortifying. If you, I mean, surely buying any game makes you a simp of that game, technically. So I guess it checks out. No. No. The flippers would be so nice here, actually. Come on. No. Piss man. By the way, you may have noticed when the flippers showed up, certain pegs disappeared. I actually did an experiment off stream at one point where I got like the last peg in the entire level was a it was an orange peg and it was right down there where the flippers appear. And oh whoa, okay. Uh shit, I'm doing terrible. Basically, I wanted to see what happened if you activated the pegs, or the, the flippers, when the last remaining peg was right there. And it just moves it. It just moves it somewhere else, basically. So, uh, great fun fact. Truly exciting. I did not do well. Oh shit, I have the flippers. 
Uh, I wasn't, I, my mouse wasn't on screen. I had to, it was off screen and I had to get it on screen and I didn't get it on screen in time. <gasps> oh. 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 This time I'm paying attention, I'm ready. I'm sitting here and I'm ready. Oh, I guess I can use space bar. I just didn't think in time. Also, my keyboard's kind of tucked away right now, the way I'm sitting. Fuck, no, I wanted it to rest on there. Oh. in the little place. Bad angle. Ooh, barely made it in. Legos aren't regulation. Yeah, this headpiece is almost certainly custom. There's some great Mr. Game & Watch cosplay pictures on the internet. Where they tried. Gosh darn it. They tried. Well, I came close. I came close. Nice. Oh my god. Oh my god, I feel like this is a depressing... This is a depressing one. The fuck? Why is he in the shower? I don't... I'm uncomfortable. Nice. But, uh, yeah, after this, I will be playing Peggle 2. Not, like, today, but, uh... That will be the next Peggle game. I have Peggle 2, I bought it on my PS4. So, can look forward to that. And I don't know if I'll ever do Blast, possibly. Uh, and, and Dual Shot, that was the worst, would probably be a far in the future one, because that's, uh... Essentially a remake. Or a port, or whatever you want to call it. I don't fuck ever. It's like on the DS, so it's actually a little different. Nice. I've heard Peggle 2 has plenty of issues, so uh, I'm ready. Whoa. Alright. Didn't even have to interfere there. TNG episode today where Troy turns into a frog and I was chanting in front of my TV. I was like, frog, Troy, frog, Troy, 
Frog Troy. And then and then Riker turned into a caveman. And I was like, caveman Riker. The binary for this one was a Rickroll link. That's good. Oh shit, it's Isaac. It's weird hearing Isaac talk or seeing him speak in text even. Oh god, there's piss in this one. He's peeing. Great. Wonderful. Way to make everyone uncomfortable, Isaac. God, look, it's miserable! Miserable slide! Oh. <laughs> uh, Cake Troy was semi-recent, yeah. Data! There was one episode where they lost all their memories. Oh, shit. Spooky ball. Okay. There was one episode where they lost all their memories, but they all still had accents and shit. It didn't make any sense! It was like, basically, it was like, oh, we lost our memories. But really all they forgot was their name and ranks. Because <laughs> once they figure out their name and ranks, they can operate the ship perfectly anyway. It's like, they shouldn't know how any of this shit works. They should be going goo goo gaga and shitting themselves. Great. Great googly moogly. Bop, bop, bop. Mom, mom, mom. Yeah, it just says Spooky Ball up there. This one's unaltered. Some of them have had goofy shit written there. This one just says Spook. Bad. Oh, just bad. What is the context of going goo goo gaga and shitting themselves? It must have been something to do with chat, I don't know. Oh good. That's good. This is good. This is nice. <laughs> oh, I <laughs> that throws me off every time. Jarring music. Nice. Get that free ball. Get that spooktacular. We're gonna get to hear so much of this theme. Oh. Okay. <laughs> it started to go into the... We, we heard the first note of that part. Yeah, I wonder if one of the Peggle Masters is just gonna be me. The Zen Ball, perhaps? That would be funny. Oh. Uh, no, I've never played the Binding of Isaac card game. I forget what it's even called. It's like Four Souls or something like that. Whoa! No, uh, not really my type of thing. Not big on tabletop gaming, really. It's just not for me. Woo! Doing good. When I started off this stream, I was like, man, this game's gonna be kind of hard. And maybe there'll be some trickier levels later on, but I've been doing better now. Saying that is like saying you don't like reading. Well, I'd, I haven't sat down and read a book in like years, so checks out. 
It's like reading, reading like a, the fucking like milk carton at the store. That's one thing. Reading books. Eh. I know I should read. I was a fucking book nerd when I was younger. When I was a little kid, I was reading all the time. But that's just because my parents wouldn't let me have video games. Can a book do this? <laughs> Shit, that was bad. Ooh, yep. That's, I knew it was bad. I knew it. Time to bite the bullet. Yeah, I guess the most recent thing I read was JoJo. Doesn't even feel like it counts because it's a comic book. Oh, stretch. Oh, good. More, more slides that won't slide. Yeah, Mike. Come on. Ooh, yeah! Nice. Spooky Ball is mediocre. In this particular version. There would be... This game would have its own tier list of Peggle Masters. It would be slightly different. Very nice. Very nice, sir. Sometimes I kind of sound like... Oh, uh, what is his name? Mr. Burns' ass assistant, Smithers. Smithers! The Simpsons has, like, the opposite effect of, uh... Patrick Warburton. It's like, everybody has Simpsons voices. Also, I think this peg is now impossible to get. I think that I have genuinely screwed myself over for this level now. Because look at this. Look at that. I can't get it. <laughs> I can't get it unless I go get a rebound here, I guess. Oh, and there it goes. I think I am actually screwed. I think I am legit totally screwed here. There's no way to get this peg. <laughs> Just believe. <laughs> Not even gonna get the second to last ball. That's it, I can't, I can't do anything. Nope. <laughs> Are you even aiming? I, I can't. I can't thinking you know it, man. Shit, oh. All right, that's fine. That's okay. Nice. Bruh. Yeah, I just realized the ball gets replaced with a tier graphic. I was like, what is this graphic? I was like, oh, it's a tier. Because it's definitely different from the normal game. Nice. Oh. Nice. Get one on the way out. I've also got other PopCap games to play still, like Chuzzle, Zuma, Bejeweled, 
Haven't played any Bejeweled on stream. Played a little bit of Bookworm, and that wasn't really a great streaming game. But I like Bookworm. Ooh! I played Plants vs. Zombies. I played in Santa Quari in San Aquarium. So don't worry about that. Got those classics out of the way. Ooh. Nice! That was good. Uh, no, I did not play Zoom Beanies. I have said the word Zoom Beanie in the Cuphead Glitch video, but I have not played Zoom Beanies. Is that gonna hit it? No! I didn't want that to hit it! No! Come on, don't- No! No! Oh, it's so- It's destined. It's destined to go in the trash, man. Uh, no, Lark and I have not beat Bloodborne yet. Uh, we're probably like one or two streams away from beating it. Uh, we just haven't streamed in a long time because uh, my hand. All right. I'm back in the and I'm not gonna lose. True words of wisdom. struggling at the beginning is just because Super Guide is such a shit ability. Especially when you're a Peggle God like me. By the way, Andrew, if you're watching, I sure would like that Lark Souls thumbnail. Thinking about, uh, if, if you don't put out that Punch-Out video tomorrow, I'm gonna put out a Lark Souls tomorrow. Oh, good! Good for you. Get a free ball. Get a free ball. Get a free ball, 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 ball. Thank you. Hop up a bee. Someone said I have no idea why, but Isaac gives me Lord of the Flies vibes. It might be the boss called Duke of the Flies. And also children dying. Uh, this will be kind of tricky. Oh, it'll be very tricky. Actually, never mind. No, I just completely solved my fucking problem. Never mind. <laughs> never mind. Game's over. Game's over. Bye. Game's over. Bye. That's true. And there's also the transformation. Yes, astute observation chat. Lord of the Flies is not actually about flies. It's very true. <laughs> Never seen this many viewers before. How many do we got? It doesn't let me see on Streamlabs. I have to like go to my own Twitch page. <sighs> We got just almost 400. I don't think that's quite record breaking, but that is quite a lot. Never had a thousand. Come on. Oh, even that, even the smallest of slides is taken from me. Uh, uh oh. There's an uh oh peg up there that we gotta get. Before I get anything else, that's an uh-oh peg that I have to hit with a rebound shot or else I'm screwed. 
Okay, phew. Danger, crisis averted. <laughs> I like the music layering over itself there when it goes too fast. A beep. Glad that's not a scum peg. Y'all remember that episode of Star Trek where Jordy fucks the Enterprise? <laughs> that's a good episode. Oh shit! Oh no! That's just how it is on this bitch of an earth. That's a good, that's a good negative coin toss graphic. Oh shit, that was it. Oh no. Cock. That's true, Jordy does fuck the Enterprise at a certain point. He has a romantic relationship with the Enterprise. Whoa! Yeah, two scum pegs here. That's Simon Pegg's brother. Scum and Peg. <laughs> nice. That was too late. I knew it was too late the second I fired it. next oh my god harry potter potter champ can i see it in the chat and he's it's his guns akimbo pose whoa i've been pegged well you know the saying when life gives you lemons i don't know bathroom mirror this is clearly not the bathroom mirror well, here we are. This is when I opened up this game with a completed save file. I looked at the quick play and I saw that there was a Harry Potter set of levels. So, uh, that's good. God, no slides, just none. What is his ability even? Oh my god! That was, uh, I'd, I'd just like to point out fake gamer moment. Because that was not Alhamora, that was Rick Sempra. It's the flower power. That was the symbol for Rick Sempra and the sound for Alhamora. Just saying. Oh, piss off! I wanted to go at a harsher angle! Twice in a row now! It doesn't go. This has been a miserable attempt. That's close. I just can't wait till the dragon. Oh! 
Yeah, it does say Richter Semper at the top. Come on. Nope. Nope. Boom, boom. Nice. That's good. You want it with the flower power, you want to get it as early as possible. That's just basic. That's just math. Oh my god! Wait. <laughs> Fuck. Why did Venture Brothers music play? I don't get it. I actually saw him that time, though. You're not just going crazy, chat. Sheldon is in the game. Zagimba. What even is Bazinga? Is it, it's just like he like whenever something happens on the show, he like says it when there's like a joke. Is it like gotcha? That's that's how I how I sort of heard heard it as. It's like a, oh gotcha. Yeah okay. Bazinga is his last name, that's why he says it. That explains the whole thing. Thank you, chat, very much for that completely legit info. Of course. Whenever he uses sarcasm, supposedly. And then the and then the girl watching the show that has a t-shirt that says fluid in sarcasm goes, oh! So funny. I did it. Oh, look at this! Look at that! That's very cute. It's the it's the training for the spell, and they drew it out. That's nice. And they put little hats <laughs> and a dunce hat on Lockhart. Tee hee. We're gonna cast Rick to Sempra on Harry, and we're gonna fucking unlock Lockhart's heart. Look at that. It's a pun. <laughs> Shit. Sometimes I kick my, uh, I have like a, uh, what do you call it? A, a st strip plug? What, do you, what the fuck do they call it? I'm blanking on the term for these things that you, it's like a big strip that you plug a bunch of stuff into, but I, I, every once in a while I'll kick that and I'll be like, oh, did I just turn off my computer? Power strip. I don't know why I strip plug, weirdo. Yeah, that's what I was thinking of. Thanks, chat. I guess it's also a surge protector. But power strip is what I was looking for. I mean, there was one time playing like Smash Bastards that I like kicked the cable and, and there was a match that was just done in complete darkness. God damn it, that one's in such a shitty spot that I don't even, it's not even worth getting. That was good. Oh, that was good. Ooh, this is actually good. Come on, get in there. Yeah, do some damage. Woo! Woo! Bada bing, bada boom! I'm so good at that now. That's like, that's something that used to be Pog and now it's not, it's hardly even Pog anymore. Oh no, it's Peeves and Filch, the things that scared me. We're gonna have to beat him in a peg off to get our beans back, folks. These were the two things that scared me in the original game. We still haven't played uh, Harry Potter 1 for PC yet. We will. But that was one, there were levels with Filch that freaked me out, and there, there was parts where Peeves showed up that freaked me out when I was bad. Look how long these block lads are. Long boy. You know, 
what seeing Peg off reminded me of is I think I'm also perhaps going to do a playthrough of off and uh, and Yume Nikki for Spooktober because those are those are classic sort of spook games. I wanted to play Spec Ups the Line, Spec Ups, Spec Ops the Line this year, but uh, I just don't want to do a first person shooter right now when my hand is in this condition. <laughs> Whoa! But Off is a relatively short and sweet game. Uh, I've never played Yumi Nikki before, but it should be good. I take it Yumi Nikki is also not super long, right? Probably. The hardest thing about Off is the puzzles, and I already did my time solving some of those puzzles when uh, when I played the game for the first time. And I'm, I'm not about to go through it again, so I'm just gonna fucking look them up for the, the stream. Gotta be honest, fam. God damn it. That's not good. It's not looking good for our hero. It's me, I'm the hero. Come on, no! I'm gonna start doing fucking real chimp sounds. <laughs> so, so much tension. Alahimura! Yeah! Double Alahomora attack. Du double rectum sempra. Yup, yup. Yup, yup, yup. Yup, yup, yup. Alright, well, look at this destruction. What's going on right now? Oh, fuck that! Look at the bounces! The bounces are terrible! Some of the bounce angles just don't make any sense. That one made more sense. Bup, bup, beep. Nice. Look at this shit. This is what happens when you peg me, peeves. You get fucking destroyed. Nice. Really, you know, preferably I would like to dominate Peeves in this. So we, we might have to go for a full clear. Not a good start to the all clear. In fact, this is gonna be real tough to do that with, just from the way this is arranged. Mm. No, a man can dream, perhaps. Perchance to dream, perchance to meme. Right at his dick. Right at his dick. Oh. Oh. I wanted a peanut. That's the thing that really kills my wrist is scrolling. Shit. Man, I remember those vases really specifically, actually. I know this is a screenshot from the first game, because it has those vases. Oh, look at this. Very unfortunately, uh, the, the scores are not, like, two billion to zero or whatever. 
Didn't we give Slytherin like negative 10,000 points or some shit like that? <laughs> those, those little voice clips freak me out every time. By the way, in the Peggle Extreme video, there was a part where like the heavy came up and he went like, you did well or whatever. And uh, I was like, oh, they even got like custom voice lines. And I got a few comments on that video of people going, has he played TF2? And I was like, oh, God. No, I didn't mean like that. I meant custom for fucking Peggle. <laughs> Nice. That's pretty good. Ooh! Ooh! Alright, get a few more, get a few more! <sighs> Peggle doesn't have a lot of, uh like straight up and down 90 degree angle blocks like that, you know? So we're getting something new. Totally new and original. Nice. Only got three balls left to get to the bean bonus room. Oh no! Oh no! Rhymes are my dove. Yeah! Come on, come on. Yeah! Woohoo! Fuck yeah, I was like, it can still happen. Nice. Yeah, beam! I think we've peaked. Not even Voldemort can top this. Bean bonus room, baby. That's adorable. Oh, look how terrible this green peg placement is, especially for flower power. Dear God. That is like the worst it could have been. Oh, look at that. Yeah, 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 yeah. What is this? What's going on here? What is this? Look at that! It's got some fucking, like, when you go out of bounds in a Valve game. Shit. I don't know exactly what that effect is called, but you know what I'm talking about. Oh! Pissed right off! Mmm! It's not even, like, worth getting the green pegs anymore, because each one's gonna get, like, one orange peg. That's so weird, like, you can see the ball falling down there. Like, look at this. It's like three. Jeez. What a miserable attempt. Okay, you know what? Theoretically possible, but not likely. Bean? Bean? Oh, fuck right off. Oh, no. No, Bean, Bean! Bean! I have to go for my, uh, my special move. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Extreme. Oh, those are in the exact same spot, too. That's good. Well, thankfully, Rick December is actually in a good place now. Come on, get them both. No! And my father, too! I'll find them both! Mm. Come on. That would have been such a good slide. There's a new Harry Potter game on the PS5. Uh, uh, mm. I'm sure there is. Isn't that like, that's like all the PS5 has. It's just like a bunch of weird like sponsored games where people are like, oh. I don't know, I'm actually, I'm not like actually a huge fan of like 
the idea of a Harry Potter video game, whoa, bottom of the screen was going extra crazy. It's just the, like, old jank ones that I have nostalgia for. Oh shit, oh shit, it's Andrew! Oh my god! Oh, he's the hat guy, because he's got a hat, I get it. Lucky spin is the best, though, three quarters of the time it sucks, magic hat makes it all worth it. <laughs> oh, nice. Haha, -ha, that's me. Alright, we finally got the best ability, the hat! Come on, come on, come on, no! I'll find them both. Oh, come on, yeah. <laughs> no, not today. Also, it plays real clown music. I love the incredibly adept photoshopping that has been done in this game, especially on that wheel. It's seamless. Spooky ball. I kind of was thinking like maybe it just actually makes it so it does nothing. But no. Ah. You know, I think when I was messaging, I think I told Andrew about this, and I was like, for all I know, there's like a picture of you in the game. And he was like, holy shit. And this is kind of similar. Similar idea, concept. Oh. Alright, big trick shot. Big trick shot. Alright, you've never seen this before. Shocked gasps, alright? Oh my god. Free ball! No, I, I don't. I got nothing. Shit. Yeah, someone should mention this to, uh, to Andrew. I'll, I'll text him. Will you be getting the PS5? Uh, yes. Uh, just for Demon Souls and Elden Ring and nothing else. I messaged him saying, you're in the game. Oh my god! It's the monkey mug! That's amazing. How did they get this picture? I guess there's like other monkey mugs online. That's pretty great. Well, I messaged Andrew, so he should show up and see this. <laughs> Whoa, my God. It says something different for each ability. That's that's pretty cute. Oh, good. Oh, good for you. Useless. Extra ball. Good. <laughs> Good! Good! 
Oh, oh, what's happening? Oh my god! Oh, I wanted the slick trick. I like- I like the ones that don't say get good. Those now make me chuckle. The worst. Must be the flower. <laughs> nice, that's good. You want that. Definitely want that. Oh yeah, and people have been asking. This will of course be an edited video. I wouldn't just relegate this to Twitch scraps. <laughs> Yeah, it is a missed opportunity to put pegs on his asymmetrical nipples. Huh. Huh. Alright, let's get it. Meh! Hog champ. Must have been point bonus. It remains to be seen whether the fifth base bit will be edited in. That is something that I think about whenever I make like a super inappropriate joke. I'm like, is that going in the video? Probably. According to YouTube, vulgar things don't matter if they're not in the first couple of seconds of the video, or first like half a minute. Just get it. Just get it. Get it. Mm. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> this is so close. Oh. I was doing so good, too. <sighs> we have not yet got the hat ball ever. Hmm. Time to do the real hat ball strat and just reset until you fucking get it. Bada bing bada- oh! oh, super guide. Oh yeah. Futile. Oh, we finally got it. Oh, it's actually his little Manico hat. That is amazing. And also, wow. What a difference getting an actually good ability makes. Yes, go in. Go in the cup! In the cup! Yes! You bastard. In the cup. Uh, I would consider myself an authority on Peggle, yeah. I know that sounds so, like, twatty, and I'm sure there are people who uh, you could consider, like, better than me at it. But, uh, yeah, I would say I am probably one of the most knowledgeable people about Peggle in the world. I, I doubt there are- I mean, now there's quantifiably- there's, like, nobody who's played as many Peggle games as I. I guess I haven't played, like, Dual Shot and shit. There's actually a few versions of Peggle I haven't played yet. Have I considered going pro? That's kind of what this is, I guess. Somebody posted on the on the Grapefruit subreddit. They were like, oh, I did... I 100%ed Peggle Deluxe just to show I could do it better than him. And I was like, bro, good luck with Peggle Knights. That's the real hard one. You have done it almost half as much of the 100%ing as I have done. Peggle Knights is the real nightmare, if you'll pardon the pun. Come on. No! Cause that, that one's got ace scores, and those suck. <laughs> oh. 
No. Nice, I guess. So that's probably nice. Shit. Hit the purple one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank... Come on! It uh, turns out the hat ball makes a lick of difference. Now let's see if I can get the true cursed one. The rim bounce, the like pixel perfect rim bounce. Oh! Free ball? No, okay, well, I'm not gonna risk it. Another ultimate extreme favor for me. Thank you very much, Pego Simp. Ouch, that hurt. Also looks like Lark's busy. He didn't respond to my text or anything. And he's not here. Sad. Oh, let me get it in. Oh. Just kind of wedged itself in there. Nice, nice, nice. Pretty good. That's dead. pretty good. Pretty good, actually. You want true CBT, Peggle? 100% uh, Peggle Extreme. Or Peggle World of Warcraft Edition. That's like true nightmares. Shit. Shit. Because that one you don't have any of the abilities. You just have Ultra Guide. Come on, get in there. Get in the lasagna hole. Oh shit. I bet that's what Garfield calls his mouth. And his asshole. Yeah. Nice. Nice! Oh my god. Payback time. Revenge never felt so sweat. Punishment and reward. That's something he says a lot for some reason. What a just shit show first couple of shots. Let's see what we get. Meh! Score tripler. Hmm. Uh oh. Look at that scum peg up there. Scum peg. No! No! Yes, okay. Phew. Get it out of there. Yahoo! Bing, bing, wahoo. I've been enjoying watching Vinny play Mario Galaxy. I really don't watch him stream much anymore, but... Mario Galaxy, I made an exception. It always weirds me out. He, he'll play it for like two hours and then he'll be like, okay, that's it. And I'm like, what? Don't you just want to play it forever? <laughs> but that's that's the nature of his particular streaming demon. Is, uh... Great. Uh... He does multiple games in a day, you know? Whereas I like to 
like to do it all in one fell swoop. Wow. Oh. 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 I don't know, like with the, I like to, you know, a lot of games, a lot of streams I do. Uh, God damn it! The game ends up, or the stream ends up being like an hour, hour and a half, or whatever. Sometimes, or like two hours. But with a game like that, like Mario Galaxy or Hollow Knight, there are certain games where I'm just like, I just want to play this forever, and I play it until I actually get like exhausted of streaming. You know, play it for like seven hours. not going so hot. Oh, it's not going so hot. Oh. Oh, there's a, look at that green peg. Look at that sneaky green peg. I didn't even realize that was there. Also, what does that say? It's like pants and then something else. Uh, this hat. This hat could clutch it through. I didn't even hit this one! Fucking that one! How? Alright, I got it. I nailed it. By the way, this has been super cute. I've been I've been enjoying this. Uh, all the little custom touches here. Matt. God damn it! Get triple score on that. Yeah. Fiddle dee dee. That would require a tetanus shot. God, I've been on a Simpsons roll today. What the fuck is up with that? I don't even like watch the Simpsons. It's like the fifth Simpsons reference today. Ooh, it's been a bad run, folks. Try it. Man. Could be good. Could be bad. Could be a mixed bag. Okay, great. It is hitting pegs. The ball is hitting pegs. Mm. Come on. No. No. This is quite the hazardous level. I guess you could say I have quantifiably played the most versions of Peggle that use this, like, engine. I think that much is true at this point. If you consider this hack a unique Peggle game. I don't know, it's kind of stretch. Kind of stretchy. Stretch my asshole. Oh. I don't know. It's just heart of the cards. There you go. Uh, is this gonna hit it? Shit. Yeah. Hmm. Oh my god. Mr. Bean, Lord Bean. Okay, well, some people say the developer ran out of ideas. I say he just really likes beans. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, it's the dragon. 
I am an actual bean. It looks like it says fans there. Th so this is you guys in the chat. Look at this fucking cluster. Oh. Do you guys remember Hannibal Bean? If any of you ever watched Shaolin Showdown? It was like the- that was like- there was like a trend of like tiny villains with deep voices after Plankton. Oh shit. What the fuck? Beans? Okay. That was interesting. Nice. Wait, what is- is the ball a bean when that happens? Oh my god. The ball is a bean when that happens. That's amazing. Yeah! What? Oh. Also, it said God up there. That, like, sound effect playing about a trillion times in one second was interesting. Nice. Doing pretty good. Like, what was another example of, like, the little guy that goes like, Hey, Mr. Krabs! Except not Plankton. There was another one, right? Hamster Veal! In, uh, in... What was it? Lilo and Stitch, the, like, TV show. He was a tiny little puffy hamster, but he had, like, an intimidating voice. That was just a joke that they love in that, like, era of cartoons, I guess. Bup, bup, bup. You need the coolest shot ever. Just you wait. Nope. Not that time. This time. Nope. I just keep missing. I just. Oh, I suck at aiming. Nope. What is the best bean? <laughs> what is the best bean? It's like anime. Who is best girl? Best bean is pork and. <laughs> I like scene bean. Oh. Scene bean, like the actor. Nice. Oh, right, slides don't work. God damn it. Sorry, scene bon. Yeah, sorry. I don't know what this music is, by the way. It's like D Dark Souls music or some shit. Oh, mamma mia. That's a spicy bean. Interesting. Nice, nice. Okay. 
this. Uh... Shit. It's not looking so good, man. Like, man, I don't know about this, dude. Isn't it gay, dude? Man, I don't know about this. It's pretty big, dude. It looks like I might choke. Oh! Does it like say something? Does it say like Bean or D&D &D or something? Clicked on accident. Fuck me. Sometimes that happens. All right, this is better anyway. Mm, no, not good enough. Not good enough! Ah! <laughs> ah! Nice. On you. These last few ones are going to be very tricky to get. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Whatever happened to your fan art website? Well, I tried to set up a Buru, but apparently there are two identical, nearly identical versions of Buru, one of which is exclusively used for like horny websites. Which I did not know about, uh, so I, I vetoed it. I was like, no, I'm not gonna do this. I don't know if anybody knows, I, I don't know how to get the real website that's not covered in Elsa sucking cock ads. I would love to know. Nice. You gotta code your own? Great. That's like the answer to every technology problem in the 21st century. Is be a programmer. <laughs> Have taken many college classes on this. Oh, bad, no. From the second I clicked, I knew it was bad. Yup, yup, yup. So I guess if that's the case, then uh, there won't be a Buru. I don't know, a bunch of people asked for it. I, see, I always just knew it as like, Vine Sauce has their, their fan art hosted on a Buru. And it's not covered in porn ads, which must mean they did it custom or whatever. <sighs> Would that it twere so simple. Yep, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. HTML isn't a programming language, so you don't need to be a programmer. I hope you can like hear the expression that's on my face through my voice right now. I hope that like comes across. Mm 
You know, I get the question, what would a grapefruit taste like a lot? So much that it's in the FAQ. <laughs> so, there you go. Oh! God damn it. Mm. Not looking so good. Fuck. Ooh. All right, at least it got that one. Or it got, it got those two, rather. It could be done. It could be done. Come on! Nice. Put it in the trash. Put it in the trash! Oh. Jelly beans. Those are the druggies. <laughs> that, this was a plot line in Pajama Sam 3, You Are What You Eat From Your Head To Your Feet. Where there were jelly, bean, jelly beans versus kidney beans. And they're like racist. Nice. I like that the opening picture was Mr. Bean, and then this- it's just a can of beans. <laughs> yeah, and you have to get Robotnik's mean bean machine to sort them. I don't know how to do a good one here. No. Oh. Mm, oh, mm. oh. Caveman noises. Oh, oh. Look at this miserable one, though. Like, that's never gonna happen. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh, man. Come on, just get a free ball. Yeah! Abba. Uba. No. No, 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 no. No, no. Definitely not. Oh god, I still have to rebound here. Oh, oh my god. Fucking Peggle Legend. Peggle Legend! Bush's baked beans. I want to meet my teachers. No, not if they're fucking beans. Is it gonna hit them all? <gasps> oh yes! Nice. Look at that. Sexy bean deletion happening here. All right, you know what? I'm fine with that. That was actually okay. Delete Bean. Nice. Oh, it didn't get a free ball! Mmm. Oh, go eat a bean.
Alright. Eat like a bean and you're done. Oh, okay. Oh, his eyes. Ah! This is an interesting configuration. Is this just like a bean costume? Just dressed as a bean? What a bizarre Halloween costume. This is gonna take years off my life. That's good. This is good. <laughs> One more layer to go. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> I'm gonna save that replay and it's gonna take up like 10 gigabytes of space. Oh shit. Oh wait. You could you could get some like cheesy shit. Where you just repeat the sound effect, you know? You know what I'm talking about? So now... Yeah! That's no, not as cool as I thought it would be. Very sad. I mean, those... These bricks are top priority, man. Ooh. Good. Still, I'm like not guaranteed a win whatsoever here. The way this level is laid out. The way this level is hung. That is to say, Captain, like a horse. Shit. Oh! -ho! I don't know how to go about getting some of these, man. Nope. <laughs> mm. been defeated. It's me! Hey, nice. We thought it might be a thing. What is the, what's like the one after the last one? Oh my god, it's Booba. <laughs> I want to see the Boobas dancing to Peggle music. They have like that kind of like weird dance. That went along with the music really well. Nice. Oh, 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 yeah. So it's it's Zen Ball, right? I think. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. My guess is it's gonna be like Slick Ball, right? Uh, yep, yep. <laughs> That's the one! <sighs> well... It's gonna go in? No. Oh! Oh! Good slick shot. Alright, uh, what, what can you do, game? 
<laughs> Give me another one. 420% more zen? Did it really just say that? What is the what is the image that is the ball? I'm very confused. The ball was like a weird thing. Good shot. Trying to do like the crazy rapid fire, but it's it's not working out. Oh, mamma mia! Nice. Mm, get one more. No. Just like casually trying to 100% some of these, you know? Just casually getting that shot that I just got and not even making a big fucking deal about it because I'm badass. Also, fuck. Also, fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> this is a joke that like anybody, like people on the main channel, they're not even gonna get. They're not even gonna get it. This was, uh, there was a sand game that I played, and I, I, I drew Luigi in it, and this is that Luigi. that big donger. I want to get it inside Luigi's big donger. Come on, go in. No. In. In! Ah, it wasn't even good. It wasn't even good. Oh, drop it right in, Luigi. Thanks. Thanks for that. It's especially poignant when the shot is terrible. Nicely done! Very nicely done. Boom. Also, I didn't mention this, but Extreme Fever is a different color. It's like the most slight change ever. Good, getting tipsy with dipshit. These are good cuts. Good cuts. Another Flash Game Friday reference. A slide. It slid for a little. Slip. Whoa. Jarring halt there. Slip. 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 Okay. Just point it at this little Uzumaki and get out of here. I think... What is the ball? Is it Birdie Bot? Is it you got got by Birdie Bot? I think that's what the ball is. Why would I shoot there? That was just a horrible place to shoot. Horrible. The game made it 160% better and it was still a poopy shot. Yada battle. Put up, put up. It's, is it is it the slick guy? It's Longmont Potion Castle. I'm being informed. Nice. 
Nice. Absolute shit and trash. These are all themed around Flash Game Friday. This one's Kermit Combat. Good. Did you know? Uh, oh, nice. Double slick. The guy that created Kermit Combat uh, commented on that video. And he was kind of like, oh, ha, ha how, how silly. You gotta remember, I think he said something about, you gotta remember, we were all a lot younger back then, or something like that. I was like, no, it's amazing and hilarious. You don't need to apologize. Shit. So much for the double slick. Didn't really get me much. Also, is this the first time we've seen moving pegs in this? I feel like this is the first instance of moving pegs. Shit. I guess I can just pick them off one by one here. Shit. Mm. I guess that didn't even that didn't even really do much. That was amazing. Now I gotta get the, the style shot here, right? I gotta. I gotta. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I've never seen the ball go that fast. It got like pushed up by these things. These things coming up like made it have extra momentum. That was amazing. Slurk. Oh. <laughs> I can't copy and paste this link, but thank you. Thank you. I actually had no idea what my catchphrase was from. Nice. That's good. That's good. Very unfortunate. Alright, let's see what you got. Mm, not amazing. Not amazing. Not good for the slick power up on the slick level, I gotta say. <laughs> ah! Ah! Rah! Shit. All right, what do you got? This is better be some insane shit. Whoa. Lame. It's kind of hard to see the arrow when it's on a pure white background, as in the arrow is literally completely invisible <laughs> on a pure white background. do that. That was some true garbage. I wasn't even thinking. I just wasn't thinking. Nice. Slurk. I did it. Master all the masters. Right, that's what the last world is. Sweet. The speedrun section. Time to compete for the best time. Oh! Oh shit! Uh, I gotta use... Which one's the dragon? Shit, I forget. Uh... Was it beans? It was beans. Let's go. Dragon's like the best one. Also, the Night Sky video is, uh... The video where I started saying slick. It's not, of course, the origin of the meme or anything, but it's where I started saying it. 
Uh, maybe this wasn't the best idea. Williams! Okay. <laughs> All right. Only true gangsters remember. Whoa! When I uh, tried to stream Night Sky Hard Mode and I just gave up because <laughs> it was too hard. It was like frustrating. Come on, hit it. Hit him, Mac! Come on. Come more? Yeah. No, I, I meant wah-hoo. There you go. Into the trash. That's what we call a trash dunk. When you walk in, oh my god. You're joking. With the little feet and everything, come on. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go with, with Lark. Because I'm crazy. Roll the dice, right? L. You gotta go RNG. For the dice level. Hit that one. Hit it. Hit it. Before the blocks disappear. No. Bing. 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 <sighs> nice. Jesus. There's been some very... Serendipitous free balls today. Okay. Spoke too soon. Spoke too soon! Alright, what do we got? Useless snake eyes! Nice. Sneaky orange peg over there. Oh, good. I mean, I got this one in the bag. It's just, I'm just picking away at it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get it out of here. <laughs> when you walk. Oh, nice. These, this is so nice. It's like a lot of a lot of games that I really enjoy. That's a uh, good touch. This is kind of a crusty JPEG of uh, of V though. Arr, welcome to the crusty JPEG. May I take your order, laddies? <laughs> Not a healthy voice to do. Slide all the way over. Yeah. That's the one advantage. Yeah! Yeah! Hit the other one. Amuse me. Nice. Perfect. Pog, peg, god. No, this room's from VVVVVV. Now, a while ago, I said I was going to play V uh, custom levels, though, and I never did. I still want to do that. There's a mod for V where it just lets you jump. <laughs> it's pretty funny. It means, like, one of the hardest parts of the game is now one of the easiest parts of the game. Nice. Actually got the hat for once. That's, that's a good feeling. Even if we don't get much use out of it. By that, I mean really not much, not any use. 
We'll have four scra Scott Traps burgers, please. Shit. Travi Patties on the house. God, Travi Patties. That's horrible. That's just truly terrible. I've got restless peg syndrome. Nice. Nice. God, I'm, I'm so good at that now. Jesus Christ. I have 420 viewers. Is that real? No. 408 to me. It, mu it might have been at a certain point. My snapshot was much lower. Just put it in the trash and get out of here. Yeah, okay. When you walk. Oh shit, nice. Punch out. I was kind of. I was thinking. There's no punch out content in this game. Now there is. It's just games I like. That's the last world. Cool. We get to hit like the arc of Glass Joe's body careening to the mat. Nicely done. Oh. Oh. What the fuck was that shot? Whoa! That's a pog shot if I ever did see one. So that's not even worth it. It's, it's literally pointless to save them. I'm never gonna make another Peggle montage. God. At least triple score is okay. It's accurately titled Meh. Okay. So yeah, I, I'll reiterate. I'm probably not gonna be huge on playing more of these. This has been fun and cool. Uh, but just due to the limitation- oh, oh! Limitations of the level creator. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll take, like I said, I'll do that one stream in the future of Peggle Knight's levels that people send in, and I'll wait a while to do that so people can make some levels and shit, but uh, <clears throat> I think for the most part this is as far as I'm gonna go with custom Peggle. Might change in the future, but I kind of doubt it. Nice. Any plans for the next big sub milestone? I don't really know. I think, didn't I just recently cross 250k? 1k away from 250,000, alright. I don't know, I don't have anything planned really. Oh! Ah. Oh! Oh! Yeah! <laughs> In the trash! In the trash! Oh god. Uh. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah, let's go with the hat. Screw it. I never learn. I've literally never learned in all my years. <laughs> Just keep the clown music on a repeat. Just don't even cut it out. Just leave it playing. Honk. Oh. The real challenge will be doing this now that I've got horrible, horrible dice rolls. Oh, oh good. That's good. Pyramid was actually giving us a decent chance to get that, and I still didn't get it. Oh. Oh, get another one. Get the other one. No.
Why'd I do that? Why'd I do that? Why did I hit that the way that I hit that? Whoa! Alright, one last swag shot to seal it. Oh no! I freaking said... One last swag shot to seal it into the 100k. At least one of them wasn't trash. And let me see my reward. Walk in! Adventure complete. Yay! Oh my god, it's the green giant. The jolly green giant is here. And they're on Windows Bliss, of course. And look, he got Andrew making a little anime heart. Wow. Well, that was, uh, nice. <laughs> Not only am I a Peggle Master, I'm a Peg Master. I did it. The most important part of the game, the credits. Matthew Miacham, that's the- that's- that's not the creator of Peggle, that's the creator of Pegged. And I assume these are... people who actually worked on Peggle? I don't know. Well, very nicely done, Matthew. That was good. Real good stuff. Are these rockets something different? No, those are just normal red rockets. I was like, is that like a meme? Very, very nicely done. Very cute. And hey, the levels, for considering the limitations of it, uh, of the creation tool, the levels are pretty good. It was a good Peggle game. I'm in the credits. Who would have ever thought Grapefruit would be in the Peggle credits? I love that that's how the bean is represented here. Alright, I think that's it. It's probably just gonna loop, right? I don't think it's even gonna loop. Any secrets? Click on Garfield and make him eat a Lazog. Nope, I think that's it. Yay! Schmickhead. Nice. Oh, I did it. I guess the challenges are just, yeah. In fact, are these gonna be like broken? Hold on, let me just see. Uh, no, it looks like that's, no, that's how the level's supposed to be. I just want to take a quick look here. I don't think I'm gonna do any challenges. Uh, new challenge. I want to see if any of these are like fucked up. 40,000 pea babies. Weird. Okay. I guess none of these are like changed up. So never mind. Alright. Well, folks, that was fun. That was good. Clean, clean as a bell, all clean, someone says. Sure. Well, that was very fun. Uh, I don't, I don't really have much else to say. It was, uh, it was a cute little experience, and, and like I said, if you have uh, an inclination to make Peggle Knights levels, I will probably do a stream in the future where, I, where I'll just play a shit ton of user-submitted Peggle Knights levels, which uh, should be fun. So thanks for watching, guys. Uh, take it easy. I might stream later today. Probably not, though. Bye-bye.